So since for the desoldering multilayer video I showed some microscope shots, I decided to show you the microscope itself, uh, which is uh, one, of, one of my most favorite pieces of equipment actually. It's really fun to use and to look at things and I want to show you some magnification videos of EEPROMs, which I really love to look at. Basically this is it, it's a um, trinocular, so it has a mount for my Nikon camera actually, but um, the videos I did by filming right through the ocular, so they I don't know how they turned out actually. It has a LED light which is very bright and you really need that to get a good image here. Magnification is from 7 to 45 times here. And since it has two true view paths, one for each eye, you can actually really get a 3D look of components which helps a lot if you are soldering SMD. So actually if you are doing a lot of SMD work I can really recommend getting one of these because it makes your work so much more um, precise and it's amazing what you can hold steady with your hand if the eyes can properly see what you're doing actually. So the first piece is a Russian type EEPROM. It has a ceramic casing and gold contacts so it's probably been very expensive back at the time. It's a K573P and then there are some Kyrillic, I don't know. Date code is from 89. You can nicely see to the left um, the actual storage and the bonding wires uh, on the bottom on the, on the right. And then on the right this is probably some decoding logic, some multiplexers or something like that. Here at the left you can see there's some inscription but I don't know what that is. This is a M27C1001 from ST Microelectronics. You can see the nice colors of the reflection of the dye itself. And when zooming in, obviously the focus always has to be adjusted, which is kind of hard doing this um, or capturing this on camera. You can see that the, all the structures are a lot smaller on this chip. This here is a M27128 of ST Microelectronics. Interesting is that it appears that those are two separate dies and they just have combined them in one case to double the amount of capacity that the device has. Also very nice the row decoders that you can nicely see the bond wires. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye.